What's up, pimps and players? Today, I'm gonna be teaching you how to record your League of Legends gameplay in 1080p, 60 FPS, plus no lag, for free. You could even record Valorant, I'm just saying. <clears throat> now, I do have to say that today's video is gonna be sponsored by Meadow.tv, and I'll be honest here, you guys remember OBS? That thing gave me blue screens a lot, and it pissed me off. But now with Meadow.tv, you can record all your gameplay, and today I'm gonna be teaching you guys how to do that, so you guys can record your gameplay in 1080p, slash 60 FPS. But, we gotta finish this play first. <laughs> All right, back to the video. All right, so now the first thing you wanna do is click my link in the description below to download Metal TV. Just download it up here in the top right section and that's it, it just starts downloading. And now you got the setup. Once it's downloaded, open the setup, follow the prompts and install it. And now this is where you gotta pay a little bit of attention. You'll be brought to a sign up page where you can actually sign up with any of the following things that you see here. I actually use my league account to sign up with it and it works perfectly smoothly. You can use whatever you're comfortable with. I'm actually just so surprised it has a Riot integration. So that's actually pretty cool. And once all that's done, your signup process is done. But now we gotta get you set up with the program and basically how it all works. Next up, all you gotta do is put in your username, select the games that you play. This will indicate the program that these are the games that you wanna record. So I did League of Legends. And if you want, you can access and share clips from your phone. Next up, you can select your avatar. Um, you can also skip this process, but I just put my face in there because why not? You can follow at least one person, but you can also skip this section as well. Uh, I just followed someone random because I thought this was a requirement, but uh, you can just skip it to be honest. Next up, you're gonna be setting up your recorder. Now that 15 seconds right there can go up to 10 minutes. Of course, if you wanna full screen record everything, plus bookmarking, which is what I did, then you can do this setting. After this, just click next and you'll be prompted to put what quality you want your recorder to be in. I might feel confident and do your nuts, but for now I'm going to do full HD and if you have a low end computer, I recommend medium or high. But if you have a decent computer, go for full HD. Next up is going to be something called AI capture. Basically what this does is it captures your best moments using AI, but I'm guessing it's going to be a little bit hard for your processor. You don't have to use it and you can skip the section if you want. The next one after that is going to be recording your mic. I just use it because why not? The next one is going to be recording all PC audio or only the in-game audio. I'm going to do all because I'm a YouTuber. And the next up is going to be setting up your hotkey on how you can bookmark things or clip things. If you have your recordings on clipping, then this will clip the next 15 to 10 minutes, depending on what your setting is. If you're on full recording, then it'll bookmark basically where something happened. So when you look through the editor, you can see where that certain thing happened in your game. My hotkey is the minus on my numpad, but you can do whatever you want. And that's it. You're all set up. Now let me teach you how this works. So basically, you want to make a cool clip, you know, you want to try and practice your Lee Sin combos. This will record anything you play in League of Legends from now on, once you disable it. So you make a cool clip, you know, you make a cool play. Check this out. Oh my God, who is that? Is that Faker? You go to your match history. It's logged in. You won the game 0, zero, zero. And now how do you find the clip? Well, just go click on your library and it's right there in the bottom right. Mine is a full recording. So here is your editor. You can basically do whatever you want. You can see there's a yellow marker in the bottom, right? That's my bookmark. And that's where I tap my minus key in the numpad. And so you can see this hype faker play right here. And I finally clipped it. So it's the hype play and you guys know how it went, but I'm gonna export it. So I have this singular selection and I can do more than just clipping it. And I can show you guys some effects. It'll appear right here in the bottom left after you've exported it. And basically, you can edit and share and it'll prompt you to the screen where it's basically more of an editor and you can do a lot more things. You can title it, add other people, and add certain tags so we can get into the Metal TV algorithm. <laughs> you can use a SoundCloud library if you need or add some text or even add a GIF. After editing of uh, 10 minutes, this is basically what my final cut looked like. Don't stop. And once you've done your editing, or if you just want to upload it as is, you can actually share it to your Twitter, to Reddit, to Discord, even Tumblr, right in the app. Of course, once you upload it, you actually have your own personal link and you can actually share it to anyone you want as Metal TV has their own internet storage so you can store your videos there and share them to whomever you want. It is very useful if you want to show someone something you did in a certain game. Now, if you want to do Valorant, I have it on full recording, so you can just load it up and it will record the whole session. So yeah, I just played a little practice mode. I ain't that good, but Metal TV did save the whole thing. 
so I can show everyone just how bad I am at Valorant and I can upload it. But if you have a sick clip, something that I could never do in Valorant, well, you can definitely upload it and share it to your friends. It's super easy since you get a custom link as well. And yeah, that's going to be a basic tutorial on how to use Metal TV for you guys to record your own gameplay, as well as a really easy way to share your clips or your videos to your friends or just people in general. They have their own section where you can look at the best league clips and Valorant clips or what other games you're interested in. So if you guys want, you can check out the link in the description below and download it for yourselves. And thanks to Metal TV for sponsoring this video. That'll be it for this video, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace out.